Hey y'all, it's Caitlin. As you can see, I have a little <laughs> something that came in the middle of the day. Okay, so, wow. Uh, I did not think this was going to be this big, but it makes me really excited. Like, I thought my Linda Carter tweeter head Wonder Woman statue was big, but holy crap. I understand why they're charging so much. So, I actually got this one on Amazon. I know, that's scary. Uh, but it was discounted. It was under 200 uh, so, I decided to take a risk, and so far, I haven't gotten it out yet, but so far it looks pretty good condition-wise, like the box isn't dented or anything. I, the flap came open while I was taking it down the stairs. But, uh, as you can see, this is so cute. It's a statue of Batman, and then all, like, the sidekicks, like Nightwing and Batgirl and everyone, they're all, like, kid size, and they're, like, climbing all over them, so. This is really cool. This is the Bat Family by Q Master limited edition. I love this. And they're doing some more uh, within the same style with the psychics being kids, but this is the one I wanted badly. So it's got like an inspected by Q stick by Q Master sticker on it. That's cool. This is my first Q Master thing. Is that the same one that does the Q figs? I honestly have no idea. If not then I have a Q fig, but I don't have any statues for sure. So let's try and get this out. Oh, that's actually. That was very easy to get out. The bombshell sometime. Holy crap. Alright, so. As I am. Ooh, there was the COA, it looks like. Yeah. So it's not numbered, it doesn't look like. But. Oh, wait, yes, it is. It's right in the center, and I didn't see it. I got, I got number 18, 1,870 out of 5,000, so not bad. So while I'm taking these guys out, there is a, another statue channel, statue and Funko channel. They're getting more into Funko. They have a couple, I think just one video out right now. They only have a couple videos on their channel now. They're brand new to YouTube. Uh, Coffee Madness. I will put a link in the description for you guys to go check them out. Uh... I found them through my comment section. They started following me. Uh, it doesn't hurt that they said in a video recently that I'm their favorite YouTuber. But seriously, guys, I checked out their videos, and they're actually pretty cool. They're kind of interesting. They're different, for sure. They collect a lot of the Diamond Select statues, which I always say, yeah, they Diamond Select has the same quality, like, design-wise as you know the high dollar statues but they're made of cheaper materials so you don't have to pay as much for them so diamond select is pretty good so anyway please go check them out if you like statues and like i said more funko products they have a lot of uh the taller like the six or the ten inch uh funkos right now funko pops but i'm all i'm I'm kind of scared to get this completely open because, again, it's Amazon. But I really didn't want to pay $200. I'm paying, I'm using Christmas money right now. And knowing my family, as soon as I, because I plan on displaying this upstairs, so I'm going to have to put this back in here to get it upstairs again. And knowing them, they're going to ask me to wrap it myself and put it on the Christmas tree till Christmas. I, I have a feeling that's what's going to happen because my mom's already gotten me some stuff and she's asked me to wrap it. So, uh, oh my gosh, it's one solid. I did not expect it to be one solid piece. Like the base is, holy crap. Okay, so let's do, wow, okay. Let's do the base first. So the base seems like pretty, yeah, it's not, I want to say cheap, but it is plastic. Like it, you can bend it slightly slightly which I actually like that it'll cut down on the weight with this bad boy so yeah <laughs> and you can see the big dents I actually think this is a lot better than just putting a few pegs on there to make it molded to fit Batman's feet so it'll be a lot more steady on there I don't even know if you guys can see but instead of having like a little hole to put pegs in it's got these little spots molded for the bottom of Batman's feet so I actually really like that and holy sh I don't know if this will fit in the curio cabinet with the bombshells. I might have to rearrange. I might have to take out uh, a shelf. 
uh, these bookshelves and put it down here. Holy crap. This is the biggest statue I own. This is by far the biggest statue I've owned. And this is the year they've come out with it. I saw it when they released it at Toy Fair. Who showed it at Toy Fair earlier this year and I fell in love with it. Oh my gosh, this is heavy. Oh, but it's so cute. Okay, there's some styrofoam and Batman shoe. Let's take that off. Holy crap. This thing, guys. Oh my gosh, okay. Let's see if I can get this on now. Whew. Dang. Let's see. I might have to get someone down here to help me. <laughs> Never sa said that before with step. Okay, there we go. Oh, wow. I keep just gushing over this, I'm sorry, but wow. This is so much cuter than I realized that, that, or I thought it would be. Oh my gosh. And I do see a few paint mess ups, but I honestly don't care. So, this is adorable. Look at Batgirl. She has such bright green eyes, and this is her uh, Burnside outfit. Oh. Uh, I don't really like her Burnside outfit too much, but it is cute for this aesthetic. So, I actually really like that they used the Burnside one here. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Okay. So, oh, there's a little bit of... Why is there just one bag on Nightwing's foot? I don't know. But, so here is Dick Grayson on the side. You can see his little blue mask. It's so cool. You can't really see his Nightwing logo because, again, he's leaning over... Bruce's shoulder, but oh my gosh, it's so cute. You, oh, I'm scratching this desk so much. And there's still styrofoam, pieces of styrofoam on the boots. But, eh, it's going to get covered up in stickers eventually, right? But you can see Nightwing, he does have some blue on his uniform still, or his costume, rather. Oh, this is cool. So next to him, there is Tim Drake, or Red Robin. There is the double R in his emblem on his shirt. Oh, this is cool. He's got the inside cape still yellow. And the cape... The capes feel almost like PVC. So I don't know what the statue is supposed to be made of. Or even if it says it. Like, you can t tell the base of this thing it's pretty solid. I want to say it's resin, but I'm not entirely sure. Um, but some of the lighter parts are made with, like, rubbery materials. So I actually like that because it cut downs on, cuts down on the weight and cuts down on, you know, just the price, pretty much. I love Tim's expression. He's, like, so wide mouth and wide eye. I don't know if I can get... I might have to take pictures and put them... Uh, alongside so you guys can see him closer up but oh my gosh <laughs> I love how he's like missing a tooth too that's so freaking cute and then Damien's right next to him you can see he's really like on the back Damien's cutest on the back his his legs up like he's trying to crawl over Red Hood right here it's so cute and Red Hood's like pushing him out of the way it's so cute it's like they're trying to vie for their dad's attention Oh, I love it. Damien's has his cloak on, red and black. This is so cool. I love this. And there's Red Hood, of course. Jason Todd. Oh, man. He's got classic. He's still got his guns, or at least his holsters for guns. Nope, there's a gun in there, so... <laughs> still got his guns, even though he's supposed to be a kid. Uh, and his is the only one where I see any metallic on, which makes sense, because his hood is supposed to be made out of metal. Uh, but Batgirl's eyes, again, the green, bright green eyes, because hers is the only mask where it shows her face, so I really like that they made it so freaking bright that you can see it very, very well here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> now, the Batman has something on his belt. It looks almost like melted styrofoam on his belt, so that's a kind of a downer. But the Batman... Uh, pretty much everything except for the belt is colored exactly like the, uh, 
world's finest collection Batman, sorry. But, so, the world's finest collection has a solid color for the belt. This one has, has broken up with bits of black all around it. Um, but the symbol is the same, and it's got the purple lining on the cape. This is really cool. <laughs> I keep saying it over and over again, but it's true. There's little kneecaps on there. And it look honestly, it looks like he's about to fall over. Because if you look at his pose, like his feet and then his knees are like locked. Like if this was an actual person standing like this, his knees would be locked and he'd kind of be jutting out just a little bit. Trying to balance all the kids on him. I don't know, I think they just did that just to support the statue itself. Because it would have looked a lot better if he was more straight. I keep grabbing Batman's crotch. But, but it would have looked a lot better if he was standing more straight. But from the front, you can't really tell it. You can a little bit when you look directly at his knees. But it's okay. I mean, he is like Bane size compared to the kids here. Holy crap. He looks like freaking Bane or something. But his face is so awesome because he's smiling it's not very many batman collectibles that we see him with just and it's not even like a full-on smile it's just a barely there smile so it still like stays true to batman but oh my gosh this is so cute i love how they managed to catch really each of their personalities because batgirl's being you know kind of bubbly kind of sweet you know these two are just chilling out, kind of having fun. Nightwing has a smug look on his face, face a bit like, yeah, I'm the oldest. And then these two are just fighting like crap. <laughs> Damien and Jason are just fighting each other. I love this statue so much. Again, there are a few flaws, and for what you pay for this, like original price, this thing is over 200 So it, it it's really kind of sucks <laughs> to get one that has i again i'm gonna take some pictures and show you guys because this is way too big but the there is some stuff sticking to his bat belt or utility belt and you can see i probably won't take a picture of this but on his bat symbol you can see some runoff paint on the black as well excuse me as well as some on the belt surprisingly however all the kids I keep saying kids sidekicks their paint job on those look pretty spot on. Like, I can see a spot here and there, but nothing to, like, bitch about. Holy crap. <laughs> this is, without doubt, the biggest statue in my collection now. I'm going to figure out what to do with it. Oh, I love it, though. I truly, truly love it. I just love how, again, he looks like Bane compared to all the rest of them. This is so adorable. And I've been wanting this, again, since Toy Fair, since they showed it off at Toy Fair earlier this year. So, I knew I was taking a risk with Amazon, but in this case, Amazon came through. It was packaged really well, a box within a box. Uh, not really any cushion, there wasn't any bubble wrap or anything, which I would have preferred. But, but, you know... It came through. It came in one piece, so I'm very, very happy. Uh, I love this thing. <laughs> so, you guys let me know your thoughts on this, and uh, uh, I love it. Again, make sure to go over and check out uh, Coffee Madness. They're brand new to YouTube. In fact, right as of the time of me recording this, they have less than 10 subscribers. So, let's just see if we can do something nice and get them a, f a few more. And, uh, again, this video should be coming out long before the... Uh, giveaway happens so remember there is a giveaway going on on my channel for the christmas bulbasaur that i customized uh all you have to do is donate to some charities i will link that video in the description box as well showing you all how to do it as of the time i'm recording this still no one has entered that's fine i wasn't expecting anyone to i imagine that the final weeks before or the final days rather before uh operation child christmas and toys for tots wraps up for this year i figure that's when i'm going to get a lot of uh, entries in so make sure you check those out uh yeah <laughs> anyway guys thank you all so much for watching remember like always this is a community not a competition i'll see y'all later and hopefully i can find a place to put this thing <laughs> bye